Good morning, children. So today we are having the EBS class, and we will go to lesson number eleven, travel. Okay. So in this lesson, what are we going to learn about? We will be learning different types or modes of transportation, and you will also be introduced to vehicles. The difference between which one moves fast and which moves faster. the one which moves low and for going to each destination what kind of vehicles you all can take so let's start with the lesson how do you come to school so how do you all come to school some might come walking some will be dropped by your parents on a two wheeler that's bike scooter some will come by car bus auto right or van so there are different kinds of ways that you all come to school So, what are all these called? How do you go when you go to other places? So, if you want to go to a different place, like from here to a far away place, to a church, which is a Shivaji Nagar, or uh, you know, far places, you have to go see a temple a little far away. You all can just not go by walking, right? You all have to take a vehicle. You have to take a bus, auto, even a cycle, bike. train aeroplane everything right all these are called the vehicles so you have to take vehicles to move from one place to another things that carry people and goods from one place to other are called vehicles so what are vehicles things which are used to carry goods goods in the sense luggages you all will get cements stones for building the for construction of the houses and other buildings or you all want uh, other luggages which come from another place to another uh, one place to another like vegetables you would have seen so many autos on your way they'll be carrying lot of vegetables and going so all these you need vehicles right you can't just carry one bag on your back and go we have ten bags to carry grains and vegetables what you all will do you'll put it in a truck or a lorry correct so you need vehicles so these are all called vehicles things that carry people from one place to another are called vehicles okay write the names of the vehicles you have seen so on near your house when you step out of the house come to school on your way you will see so many vehicles right you yourself will be having vehicles at home your parents will be having vehicles at home so i want you all to make a list of such vehicles whatever you all come across you all will come across bicycles you will be having tricycle at home to ride correct or bicycles bike autos car okay or whatever vehicles you see on the road buses truck lorry you can list it out one eight vehicle you can write your eight different vehicles let's go to the next page write the names of the vehicles in the boxes which are in the picture below so they've given different pictures of different vehicles pictures of different vehicles you'll have to identify each vehicle and write the answer in the box given below i will write and send the photo of the same but i want you all also to guess what these are the first one is bicycle what is this bicycle the next one is a bullock cart bullock cart you will not find near your places much but they are in the villages they really um, they used quite often and this is a bus all of us know bus this is a train most of us have traveled by train correct train this is an aeroplane aeroplane flies in the sky and this one is an auto this is a truck a horse cart which is also called tonga horse cart this is a bike a bike motor bike and a boat okay children so write down the names and let's go to the next page list of vehicles are given below some move slow and some move fast mark the right column so we have seen many vehicles now we know different kind of vehicles but which moves fast and which moves slow how do you all know so let's see uh, let's discuss which vehicle moves faster than the other cycles so when you take a cycle you how, how fast can you all go 
from the house to school you can go you can't go very far because that's not a vehicle which can be road fast right you have to ride a cycle to a certain limited speed you can't ride with very fast speed when compared to buses and trains or bike even bike is faster than the cycle so you have to tick at the modes of uh, move slow put a tick in the slow that which moves fast tick in the column moves fast bullock cart is also a slow vehicle like cycle is uh, you know we pedal it and we ride it like bullock carts are being dragged by the bulls so that is also slow buses it's fast so moves fast stack it on the moves fast column train so write a tick on the moves fast train is again a super speed, a speed vehicle so you can tick in the moves fast column aeroplane is faster than the train you will reach in no time to very far away distances so aeroplane again moves fast lorry also moves fast horse cart is again pulled by the horse so it is not a fast vehicle it goes slow motorbike it is normal okay so you can ride it as fast auto rickshaws are slow boat is even more slow so before i go further i want to introduce you all to different types of transportation then we'll go further with the lesson so here i have written means of transportation what are these means that is types of transportation different types of transportation in the previous class i have taught you all that four types of transportations roadways railways waterways and airways and i have taught you all given you all the examples now here landways now landways is nothing but your roadways and railways put together is landways so landways are roadways and your railways so roadways all your bus car cycle which goes on the road railways are still on the land but doesn't go on the road it runs on the special track which is laid for the trains that is a rails correct so trains run on the rails though they are on the land there is a separate road or track which is made for the rail uh, trains those are called the rails so it's called railways so they both come under one category landways okay so road and rail are on the land but have a different uh, track for the rails railways so these will come under one category landways so what are the examples of landways you have buses cars train because train comes under the railway but it's still a landways okay so it's a lay, uh, train etc so you have many more bicycles okay uh, metro trains all this come under landways now let's go to the next one is waterways now what are waterways vehicles which move on water vehicles that move on water but not on the land so what are those those are waterways so waterways are examples ship ferry boat raft so all these move on water so what is ship ship and cruises are big boats very really big large vehicle which goes which carries only passengers it also can carry some uh, ships also carry some animals with them from one country to another if it's really on the ocean then you use the ships or cruise ferry on the other hand is a uh, boat a little sm smaller than the ship or a cruise but it's used to travel from one small place island to another island or small places where ferries are usually to carry luggages more than people they carry luggage then we have boats to cross on the river raft is also goes on the river you will have seen a, a tube like thing boats small boats which is used for races and all that 
that's your raft and then we have airways airways are the vehicles that moves on the in the air so what are those we have aeroplane you have jet planes helicopter then you have hot air balloon parachutes all these come under airways okay children so i have just given you all the introduction of the different kind of vehicles which moves where then i'll move on to this again so in this when as i said which moves faster waterways are usually slow they take days to move when if it, if you want to go to one country or another country on the sea then you take ship and you'll take days and weeks to reach maybe a week or something but if you take a air way an aeroplane you'll reach within a day right and your landways roads and uh, railways and that cycles and buses i mean cycles and auto rickshaw bullock carts all these are slow but when it comes to trains and buses they are really fast so our airways are very fast then comes our landways then our waterways waterways are the slowest moving vehicles okay so these were the examples of different transport now we will see how and where we will travel to rahim's hometown is in Kar is karwar his grandfather's house is in udpi He will be now living to his grandfather's house. In which of the following vehicles should Rahim travel to reach his grandfather's home early? So you have to put the tick mark. They have given a picture of a cart, bullock cart, and a picture of the bus. So bullock cart and bus both come under your landways. Okay, bus or bullock cart is a landway, but which will move fast? Which will take him soon to his grandparents' house? that is the bus so take it on the bus children next which vehicle is better for harini to travel in to go to her grandmother's house from shivamogga to tumakur put a tick mark against the correct vehicle so which vehicle is better auto will be a local transport it it might be faster than the cycle but it's not very faster than a bus or a train and it can or it can go to a certain distance right but whereas buses and trains travel long distance so if you have to travel from shivamogga to tumakur with a long way you she has to harini has to take the train okay now next page ramesh and john are neighbors in kalaburgi they work in the same office every day ramesh goes by a cycle and john goes by a motorbike both of them leave the house at the same time which of them reaches the office early put a tick mark on the space provided again here ramesh and john are from the same place their neighbors so they had a distance from home to the office is same but they take two different vehicle like ramesh takes a bike and john goes by i mean john goes by motorbike and ramesh goes by cycle so which moves fast who will reach fast the bike or a cycle so cycle he has to pedal and go all the way whereas bike he just have to start and go right so bike will reach faster than the cycle so john will reach the office faster than the than ramesh so tick on the bike okay children so next write any four vehicles that move on land so these are the examples of uh, transport any four vehicles that move on land i have written three buses cars train and you can also write bike okay so buses trains cars bike bicycle bullock cart all these move on land so these are examples of landways have you seen vehicles that move on water write the names have you traveled in them so if there are different vehicles which move on water so some of us would have traveled like if we when we go on a trip we'll go to cross a small river you would have got into a raft or a boat some would have traveled far distance on a ferry or i mean on a ship or cross the river on a boat like that so what are the different vehicles that move on water boat b o a t boat ferry ship 
raft okay you can write all these four do you know about the vehicles that move in air so we have seen vehicles that moving move in air right what are those those are the fastest mode of transport the airplane correct so write airplane there names of some vehicles are given below write there write where they move in the following table so there's a table here on page 104 i have drawn the table here so let's write down which vehicle move where okay children so let's write it down so the first column says vehicle that moves on land i mean the serial number and vehicle that move on land vehicles that move on water and vehicles that move on move in air so the first vehicle on the list is lorry so where does the lorry move on lorry moves on road that is land so we'll write lorry here lorry okay the first vehicle that moves was the vehicle that moves on land lorry next is bicycle bus so where does a bus move bus also goes on the land bus cycle cycle is again an example of land ways so cycle is a vehicle which moves on land which is the next one boat boat is an example for waterway so boat moves on water so boat moves on water b o a t boat aeroplane aeroplane flies in the sky so the way aeroplanes move on in air so aeroplanes fly in sky copy this in your textbook i'm writing it for you all aeroplane moves on moves in air car car is a another example of land ways so car moves on land bullock cart bullock cart again moves on land children so write here bullock cart c a r t cart next is our ship ship moves on water helicopter helicopter is another example of our airways so helicopter moves in air helicopter horse cart horse cart is another vehicle which moves on land horse okay horse cart moves on land motorbike motorbike is another example of your land ways motor bike so motorbike also is a land vehicle next is your yacht yacht is a water moving we i mean vehicle which moves on water so it's an example for waterways waterways okay so next is i want you all to write this copy this in the column provided in your textbook and next we'll go to the system of vehicles that move on land is land transport system of vehicles that move on water is water transport system of vehicles that move in air is air transport either call land ways waterways airways or land transport water transport or air transport next the dotted diagrams for the pictures of the vehicles join the dots and color it children i want a neat work and send the picture to me vehicles and their users are given in the following picture draw lines to match these so you have the pictures here can you see this side you have different vehicles this side you have the use of those vehicles and how and for what each vehicle are used let's see cycle 
cycle is to carry a single person so only one person can ride a cycle and go correct so cycle you have to match with one man one person can go on a cycle it's a truck or a lorry a lorry can carry goods right luggages or goods so lorry with the goods here the luggage and then bus buses carry many passengers correct buses carry many passengers more than 2 3 4 10 10 to 20 passengers the buses carry so let's ma uh, match bus and many passengers okay the next is the boat boat is to carry few people to cross the uh, across the river so the few people waiting here so very few passengers so from boat to the few passengers were waiting at the river side okay this this is the way you have to match the columns and the next is some pictures of vehicles are given above mark with circle if the vehicles carry people mark with a square if the vehicles carry luggage mark with a triangle if the vehicles carry boat now the first one is a lorry picture of a lorry a lorry is used to carry luggage or goods okay so you have to mark it with a square or a rectangle okay it's a square mark lorry with a square shape because it's used to carry luggages the next picture is a bus and bus is used to carry only people passengers they are called so circle the bus because which is used to carry people and mark the picture which carries both vehicles and people with a triangle so train you can mark as a triangle because trains are used to carry people and luggages okay you can carry big more luggages that's called goods train and it also used uh, trains are used to carry people passengers from one place to another place so you have to mark a triangle the train so that it carries used to carry both luggage and people join match boxes to make a train prepare an aeroplane with paper and fly it at home so this will be one of your activity that i'll tell you later you have to make match boxes to make a train like you know different compartments of a train or you can prepare on fly aeroplane with a paper and fly it at home and whoever has done that you all can show it to me meanwhile we'll go to the next uh, uh, puzzle who am i solve the puzzle i can fly though not a bird i do shine but i am not a star though i have wheels i am not a car i am very fast but not a cheetah so what is this it's a vehicle what vehicle that flies it has vehicles to turn wheels to take off but it flies in the air is your aeroplane aeroplane a e r o p l a n e aeroplane write it in this box provided children next one i cannot run on the road i cannot fly in the sky in the air i run at lightning speed and make a chukubuku sound so it makes the chukubuku sound what is that it's a train it goes in full speed but not in the air it goes on the land that's on your railway tracks so it's called the train t r a i n train in the box provided look one and all how i play and sail on water every day no wings to trouble and no problems i have and who am i so which is the vehicle that sails on the water is a boat okay so it it just sails and it has no wings no wheels it's a boat so write boat okay children so we come to the end of the lesson i will send you all the notes meanwhile whatever the exercise is given here copy the what's on the board and write it here okay and i want you all to copy this means of transport different means of transport and their examples in your evs class workbook write uh, lesson 11 chapter travel lesson 11 travel is the heading of the lesson 
then write means or types of transportation land ways which is roadways and railways together example bus cars and train waterways ship ferry boats raft are the examples and airways aeroplane jet helicopter these are the examples so please write it down in your notebook and send the photo to me okay thank you take care